Hey everyone, it's Alyssa from j &L Mom, and today I thought I would show you a little progress I've made with purging. Um, I followed the KonMari method um, probably about six, seven, eight months ago. I started it in my home, hey, and hey, I <laughs> one second. Wahane, hey. I'm doing a video, okay? Yep. Um, as I was saying, I did the KonMari method quite a bit ago, and I was really happy with how much I got rid of. It was amazing how much I was able to get rid of in my home. Um, but I've been recently saying to my husband, I still feel like it's not complete. I still feel overwhelmed with things. I wish I just had less. I want to live with less. So I guess I started um, the KonMari method a little bit again today. Um, when I did another clothing purge and I purged clothes not that long ago. I just, I just have a thing with clothes. I have a lot. I have a hard time getting rid of, but I think I made some good progress today and I just wanted to show you what I got rid of. Um, and I, if you're interested, keep on watching. If not, I understand, but this is probably just to keep myself accountable too for how much I have. But these are all t-shirts. This is like a camouflage shirt, a shirt, another shirt. Um, this is another shirt. This is a pair of pajama pants, two swimsuit bottoms. This is a tank top. And what I have here is another swimsuit bottom, a swimsuit cover-up, a shirt, another shirt. And then this is a swimsuit a girlfriend of mine let me borrow. I have to remember if she wants it back or if I should purge that. So... That was quite a bit of stuff, I think. I mean, it's not a huge pile, but it's a good pile. And this is stuff I should have gotten rid of before, and I haven't. So, next. What's the matter, honey? Oh, you need help? Let me help you. Hold on, we have a toy situation here. There you go. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay, so then I got all these things I'm purging. These are all mostly tops, I believe. So there's this top. I came off the hanger. There's this top. And I'm keeping these on the hanger because I'm considering putting them on Poshmark. This top. This one. This one, which is really adorable, actually. But I just don't grab for it and I don't wear it, so there's no reason to keep it. This tank. This one, this one, this is a maxi dress. It's really cute and it still has the tags on it. So I'm hoping I can get some money for that. This is also a really pretty gap top, new with tags. Um, I got it on clearance and it's really cute. I just haven't grabbed for it. And I got this, I believe two summers ago. So obviously this needs to go. Another blouse, really cute. This one also has the tag on it. Again, beautiful blouse, but I got this two summers ago. If I haven't worn it yet, I'm not going to wear it. This is an old navy top. This is something I got recently that I tried on. I got um, on a garage sale page. I tried it on. It's just not for me. Same with this one. Tried it on. It's not for me. That's the problem with buying online. Yeah, go get his hat, honey. Show me his hat. That's the problem with buying things online. If you try them on and you don't like them, especially secondhand, you can't return them. So, But, I mean, I paid a little, not a lot for it. So, it's, it's not too bad. But look at all these hangers. I mean, this is a big pile of stuff. And, I mean, like I said, I did a purge not too long ago. Um, so, I mean, these are all things I decided to keep. And I don't know why I decided to keep them because, obviously, I'm not wearing them or loving them. I don't know why my camera is not focusing. I apologize. But anyway, I just thought I would show a couple of the things. Um, I thought I would show the things that I got rid of in this small purge. And I hope you enjoyed. And I hope if you all are purging this um, back at this back to school time, I think that this is kind of my motivation. Is My son is going back to school soon. And it's freeing up a little time for me to do this kind of thing again. Um, if you like this type of video, um, I can show like a before and after too next time. Um, but... I didn't think of it, and I don't have a tripod or a good camera to film that type of video. Like, I don't have an editing program that would give me the opportunity to film a really nice before and after type of purge. But I'm working on that because I really do enjoy this, and I, I like YouTube a lot, and I want to continue with it. So I am working on that. 
but um, I can show you real quick where this stuff came from. But I feel really good with this pile. I think it's, I think it turned out good. But this is my closet, and what I did, I did my jeans not too long ago, and I got rid of like twelve pairs, and I still have a lot. I know, but. Um, this is all my clothes right here, and I'm really happy with what Mommy. I have in here. Um, these are dresses, um, these are tank Mommy. tops, these are tops, and then more tops and jeans. Yes, honey? I'm filming a video, okay? Yeah, thank you. And then back here, um, this section is actually stuff that I am currently selling, and if it doesn't sell um, this summer right now... Um, I'm going to hold on to it until next spring and try to sell it in the spring or just bring it to consignment. And then back here is sweaters. I haven't, I didn't purge sweaters or up here because, oh, excuse me. Uh, my apologies. My son is wanting to play, so I need to finish this up so we can play. I did not purge the sweaters, the, you know, the sweatshirts or the sweaters back here, the long sleeves, because, um... We haven't been through that season yet, so after we go through fall and winter, I'll go through that stuff and get rid of anything I didn't wear. Right here, I just keep um, towels for the kids' baths because they, I don't know if you have two kids or they just make a major, major, major mess when they're tubbying. And this bathroom is right off where we, uh, or excuse me, this closet, excuse me, is right where we um, give our, you know, it's right near our bathroom so this is where we give our kids a tubby so we have those towels on hand for big messes over here is my husband's side and he he did a purge not too long ago he doesn't have a lot I mean there's not a lot there um, but these need to be done and we discussed this recently he will be working on these soon and also his dresser I also have a large dresser in here that I purged um, yes, I still do have a lot of clothes. I just, I really like clothes. I'm going to, you know, probably, I'll just keep purging clothes. It's just going to happen in my life. I, I buy clothes. I go garage sealing. I buy them secondhand. I buy them at consignment. So I have to keep on going. I have to keep an ongoing purge. Um, and I'm okay with that, but I think I did a pretty good job. Again, that big stack of tops right here. All these tops. That's quite a bit, I think. That pile, and I'm happy with it. So, thanks for watching. Sorry. <laughs> I do this every time, but I'm sorry for the um, bad quality video. Um, I do my best, and that's really all I can do. And again, thanks for watching. Have a great day.